Super cool party people and welcome back to the theater. Here I am at work. It's just before eight and it is um, It's a nice day at the moment, but it's supposed to get just terrible within the next couple hours. So So glad that um, it's gonna be nice in the four hours that I work and it's gonna start pouring rain. It's fine <laughs> I had like a million random dreams last night. Okay, there was like three that I can remember and I kind of feel like they were all intertwined. Um, in one, there were like pirate ships, but they weren't like pirate ship pirate ships. They were like campy reenactment. You can go on and watch a show or you can take it for a cruise pirate ships. There's like a little one and then a really big one. I don't know. <laughs> and then I was hiding in, I was, I was like trying to get away from people and I was in the local McDonald's, which I used to work at forever ago, and I was trying to get away from people. And the person that owned it when I first started working there, like I saw him like go in the back and he was like wearing a name tag and I'm like, what happened? Why does he own this place again? And then um, I managed to get into like the back storage area because I was like, this will be perfect. I can, I don't know if I want to get some supplies or if I was just trying to get out of there, but like I had like a can of Coke and I'd like put it on the ground and then somebody was coming and I was like, oh no. I'm in disguise, but if they see the can of Coke, they'll know it's me. They didn't, fortunately. And then this other girl came up to me and she's like, oh, I want to help you escape. And so we were, we got away from the McDonald's and we were running along some trails on the edge of a field. But like, before she came with me, I'm like, people are trying to kill me or capture me. I don't know, one of the two. And um, there was like this little tiny gap where we had to go where like you could get into the field. And as we're running past that, this guy on a bike, like not like a motorcycle, but like just a pedal bike sees us. And I'm like, oh no, that's the guy that's after us. And he like chases us down. And I feel like we started to get into a fight in the field. Um, not 100% sure, I think I woke up around then. Uh, it was really weird, but definitely probably inspired by that spy movie I watched last night. Happens all the time. And then in a different dream, or maybe a different part of that dream, I was trying to, I was moving. I wasn't moving into a different house that I lived in. I was just moving to more rooms. I was like, I need a sewing room, I need an office, and I need a bedroom, and blah, blah, blah. So that was weird. And then we went shopping for, I don't remember what, but I definitely was like picking up a 12-pack of Coke, which is really funny because I haven't been drinking a lot of Coke lately. And so it's obviously in my mind that it's like, you need to put the caffeine in the body. But yeah, anyway, weird dreams for sure last night, but... Now I'm here, I'm gonna have my breakfast drink, start my day. It should be pretty chill, much like yesterday, not a ton to do, and then probably some sewing, uh, but we'll see. My main goal today is when I get home to not fall asleep. And then like the second part of that goal is to work on that list that I created yesterday, but we will see how it goes, and I'll check in with you in a bit. Well, hello and welcome back to my day, I suppose. I don't know, I don't know where I was going with, with that start, wow brain doing great things today. It is about quarter after 12, just got home from work. It was, as expected, a very chill day. Did my tasks for about two-ish hours, took my break, and then uh, sewed a bunch. So that's great. I finished uh, five seat covers, started on the next five, because I've been, I was doing them in batches of 10, but I've started doing them in batches of five, because it's much more satisfying, because you finish the batch faster. <laughs> there are not including the ones I'm working on, only 21 seat covers left, which started out as over 400, like probably like 460. So we are doing fantastic. Uh, and at this rate, especially with my main coworker, who was the only other person who was sewing regularly, except she was dealing with other stuff. She's like a full-time staff member doing other things, but when she had downtime, she would sew, but she's just been so busy because everything's been changing. <laughs> that she hadn't been doing a lot of sewing, so she took her machine home. Well, I mean, they were both her machines. Oh my God, I'm rambling. Anyways, there's only one machine at work, as I've pointed out, because nobody else has been sewing, really, except for me, and now she's uh, gonna be at home for the next two weeks because a family member has come and needs to quarantine, so she's working from home. <laughs> um, so I'm probably gonna finish all the seat covers, except for the one that is in her 
office because we decided it would only be fitting if she finished the last one because she started it. Anyways, I have rambled for way too long about that. Um, currently I'm charging my aura ring here. Um, I get really bad sometimes, I forget to charge it. So I'm charging that, then I'm gonna charge my mics later today because I don't like, as soon as they get below half, I'm like, mm, maybe I should charge them. And um, i just strings inside there. And then um, I'm gonna get on to my list. Exciting. <laughs> Um, but I think first what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go make myself some lunch and I think I'm also gonna make some shredded chicken for snacks slash to bring to work because I could probably use some. Um, but yeah, that's where I am at <laughs> and I need to set an alarm for three to put the roast in because we decided we're having roast today because I was like yesterday it was such a pain for dinner. I'm like, hey, like we have ingredients for this, but we don't have this one ingredients. We could do this, but we don't have this one thing. We have everything to do this, um, or we could do this. And my mom was like, yeah, let's do that. I'm like, oh wait, we don't have like spaghetti. And I was like, oh wait, we don't have garlic bread. <laughs> so it, we just need to meal plan. And it drives me nuts that we're not. <laughs> um, it's fine. <laughs> anyway, that's where we're at. I'm going to go feed myself, probably start the shredded chicken. And then I think, upload the vlogs I edited yesterday, maybe edit some more, deal with this mess, mostly that thing, which is my dirty clothes, so I need to just fold and put away all my other clothes, but the nice thing is, because I've just been wearing them, the clean ones out of the hamper, uh, it's almost empty. So, that's where we're at. I've been rambling for way too long, and I will check in with you, hopefully with less energy and more calmness. Alrighty, so plans changed a little bit because I went downstairs to start my shredded chicken. I was like, oh, I'm not really hungry. And so I came up and I edited a vlog. I'm about to upload the two that I edited yesterday and then the one I just did. And hopefully I can get one more done and then I'm only one day behind. But my breakfast buddy from Blind Channel just showed up and dropped off a Christmas present for me, which is like so sweet. Mm. I have um two things that I think I'm gonna give her. I think I've got like an idea of what I wanna get her, but like the thing is, so, she's because the numbers are going up in the province and her parents are a little bit older <laughs> they're like after this weekend um until the numbers go down you can't come <laughs> out and stay at the house and she's like fair enough i was surprised that they let me come out this long so yeah so she dropped off the present because i likely she likely won't be out again before christmas um I can easily, I have to send something out for somebody else out there, so I can easily either send that out with somebody or I can mail it or whatever. Who knows what might happen? Anyway, that's where we're at. That was exciting. I think I'm gonna at least get these videos uploading and then get that other one rendering. Um, and then I think I might go make myself something quick to eat. I'm not sure what I want. It's tough. Anyways, that's where we're at. Just wanted to update because. That was fun and cute. It was just like, she texted, she's like, I'm at your house. I'm like, what? Ah, I like grabbed a mask and ran downstairs. And yeah, just did a quick little hug. We're like, let's just both look away and hug and it'll be okay. But yeah, oh, I keep saying, but yeah, I'm gonna go now and just keep doing the working thing. Alrighty, it has definitely been some time, but I did get two more vlogs edited and everything is uploaded. I have been working on this embroidery piece, which I can't show you. <laughs> um, it's going pretty well. I'm trying to get this one color done and then I'm gonna heat erase all the lines and then see how I like the design from here. I've just been watching some YouTube, very exciting. I still have a mess over there. It's totally fine, um, but I think it's just about dinner time. So I'm gonna go down now, eat zeros that I put in earlier, and then um, get back to embroidering. I, I should probably, oh, right. I was gonna say I should probably look at my agenda, but I didn't actually make an agenda this week, but I do have a list. Oh, I need to do invoicing. Good thing I looked at the list. Okay, we'll probably do that a little bit later. I usually prefer to do it around nine. I don't know why. Anyways, I'm gonna go for food and I will check in with you eventually. <laughs> I don't even know. Alrighty, well it is now like quarter after 11 so I'm gonna call it a night. I um, don't know where my list went but I think I did most things on it. I 
almost finished the tote bag, I think. Um, just a little bit more on the outside design and then some pickups on the main design, so that's exciting. I also worked on my other embroidery project, so that's great. I got those four vlogs edited. Oh, right, here's my list. Dun, da, 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 da. Basically, the only thing I didn't do, because I also did invoicing, was fold my clothes. I pretty much knew that was a lost cause when I put it on there anyway. Um, but you know, it is what it is. Tomorrow is another day, and then the next day I'm gonna do laundry again anyway. So if it isn't folded then, I'll just fold it that day. But um, yeah, I'm gonna uncover my bed because there's a few sweaters and stuff on there. Um, get ready for bed, change my PJs, all that fun stuff. And with that, I'm going to say thanks so much for coming along on today's adventure, and I will see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night.